Arthur and the Real Mr. Ratburn is a really relatable episode of Arthur. This is the second episode of the first season. I'm currently re-watching Arthur for nostalgia. It was one of the shows that I binged watch as a child. Well, that's not true. It was hard to binge watch it when we didn't have online streaming, but it was something I watched every single day after school, like a lot of children. Um, I believe it was on CBBC. This particular episode, I couldn't really remember, but watching it now, definitely relatable. Arthur and the rest of the class are about to find out what each other are getting for their third grade. So realistically, this episode should have come before the other ones, um, since Arthur's always kind of the same age, they're always in third grade. But they're finding out which teacher they're going to get, and they really don't want to get Mr. Ratburn. There are some really nice third grade teachers who are, you know, really sweet. They give the children candy during the day, and they play games. And then there's the teacher who, as far as they're aware, is strict. He constantly gives out homework. Everything is orderly. They do not want to get Mr. Ratburn. Needless to say, they get Mr. Ratburn. And the episode is all about them finding out more about him and realising that maybe he's not as bad as they think. Yes, he is strict. Yes, he is disciplined. But maybe there's another side to him. And the reason that this is relatable is I think most of us, at one point or another, we'll hear rumours about certain teachers when we're at school. The older children will say, oh, you don't want to get such and such because they're the strict one. You want to get the nice teacher. And there's always this fear of this teacher. They're going to be strict. You don't want to get them for your next year. And then when you get them, you find out that they're not that bad. Yes, they may be like Mr. Ratburn in the sense that they do like order and they do give out homework and they do like things to be a bit more military almost. But actually, they have other sides to them too. They make lessons fun, they're engaging, they reward effort. And I think it's a really interesting episode from that perspective that it can, can, could encourage children to maybe, to maybe consider their teachers as human beings. And also, if you are going into a new grade or a new year, maybe don't be as scared as the older children tell you you should be. It's something that I definitely experienced growing up. I think most children do. And I really enjoyed it. It's nice to have a nice, a different look at Mr. Ratburn as a teacher. Obviously, at this point, this is the first time we get to know him. But years after the fact, looking back in hindsight, it's nice to see a different side to him. Arthur and the Real Mr. Ratburn is very relatable and a really good episode.